Chris. Well, let me uh, just try to give you a two minute or three minute update. What's going on with Founders Ministries? Uh, Founders began 27 years ago as a pastor's conference. And two years ago, we had our last national pastor's conference on an annual basis. And the reason that we decided not to go annually on a national conference anymore is because there are dozens of good conferences that meet around the United States now where good, solid reform teaching can be heard. And we have excellent regional conferences like this one. We have five regional conferences that are ongoing and others that are uh, kind of hit and miss or not every year and some that are being planned or thought about at least for other places around the country. And so we're delighted with that and love the fact that regionally we can have more fellowship and people don't have to travel as far and want to continue to promote uh, our regional conferences. And we will have one-off conferences in the future as uh, opportunity and need arises. One of the things that we have recently shifted into and are beginning to develop more and more is an emphasis on church planting. We're in the process of trying to develop a church planting network, God willing, January of 2010. Uh, we will have a launch of uh, web a website that will announce where we are and what's going on with that. And basically what we are pulling for are individuals who are committed to church planting and churches who are committed to church planting. Churches that say, yes, we want to get aggressively involved, put our money and our resources, our people into the effort of starting new churches locally throughout North America as well as internationally. So look for that, God willing, in the first of January, first few weeks of January, we should announce and launch this website that'll have more information, laying things out. And we're already developing some uh, uh, network uh, connections with other groups. There's wonderful things going on in church planning across denominational lines and we're hoping to link arms at appropriate levels and appropriate ways where we can with some of those organizations. If you have interest in that, get on the website and just email me or just email the website or from the website and we'll funnel you to the guys that are kind of overseeing the development of a database of those who are interested, both churches and individuals. If you think God might be leading you or raising up those in your church to be church planters, we'd love to connect with them and just keep you in the loop as information develops. And God willing, you'll hear more about this in January. We continue to publish books in the journal. We've uh, published three books this year. I think there are sample copies out on the four-year table for you to look at. And one of the ongoing ministries that has been extremely uh, useful that God continues to use in a quiet, a quiet way, but a, literally around the world, is the Founders Study Center. Ken oversees this. You can talk to him if you want information about it. But as of, uh, I think, last semester, we had over 600 people that have gone through different courses in the Founders Study Center. And this is people from around the world. I'll, I'll never forget the day Ken came in and showed me. He had an envelope in his hand, an international envelope. It was like $20 or $25 U.S. dollars in it. And a guy from Nigeria, Nigeria, had uh, said he'd saved up money for a year or two and s sent it with a friend who was leaving Nigeria, going to France, I think it was. And the, the letter came from France. And he said, I've got my, you know, this is a registration fee. And as soon as I can save up the rest of the money, then I'm going to try to get it to you. So I can't mail it from Nigeria. People steal it. But I'll try to get it to you so that I can ha now start taking courses. You know, man, we got that, and we, we were sitting there with tears in our eyes, and we think, we got to contact this brother. He's in, you know, and, and uh, we contacted him, and he's, I don't know how many courses he's taken, but it, we just, things like that, where people around the world, literally, have benefited and are benefiting from it. And uh, if you're interested in the study course, uh, study center, please talk to Ken or look online. The, the Founders website is back up online as of midnight last night. And so you can access it once again. But uh, we're delighted with all God's doing. Thank you for your support. And if you want to know more about how you can support Founders, talk to me, talk to Ken. Uh, we'd be glad to uh, spend more time with you privately describing some of the needs and challenges as well as the great opportunities that are in front of us. Thank you, brother. Amen.